My name is Dwayne Bevett. Uh, I was in the Army. I went into the Army at uh, <clears throat> a later age, age 27, and then I completed a 26-year uh, career and just retired in 2017. I started out in the infantry and uh, got my beginning there. And uh, after about three years, I joined Special Forces and spent the next 23 years working in Special Forces. As a kid growing up, uh, I was kind of on that very tail, tail, tail end of Vietnam at an impressionable age, the, the age of 12, 13, 14 in there. As I grew older then, uh, I started in agribusiness management when I graduated high school and was successful there. And then I went on from agribusiness to manufacturing and more success and, and successes kept building on top of each other. But I always had this drawing, nagging desire to be in the military, to have that experience, that, that life. So I finally kind of hit that crossroads. Uh, a number of things took place that kind of opened up and allowed me to, to make that personal decision as to whether I ever wanted to pursue that childhood dream, that, that young man dream of, of being in the military or not. And so basically uh, I walked away from everything that I had done up to that point in time at age 27 and said, yeah, I'm gonna take this shot. I'm gonna take this chance. And I did. People at 27, a lot of them considered to be themselves to be settled down, you know. But he is so built for service that he just blew through any barrier or any consideration, you know, thrown his way. And we were like, "Did you talk to anybody about it?" He's like, "No, I just, I just knew I." He talked to himself about it, and he he had that much resolve, and he was that driven into his purpose that he just blew through. This guy, we went through a, a lot of details and they all didn't make it into the song. But this guy had screws taken out of his elbow that were there since he was 13 <laughs> because he learned he couldn't make it into the service. So he's like, Doc, take him out. And, and to stay in as long as he did Mogadishu and then continue to serve after that is, uh, I would say, uh, we could never follow what you did. Mm. Writing songs is fun, but that's that's really uh, it means a lot more than I can tell you. And then you hear him say that if he could, he'd do it all again. Yeah. And it's like, man, that the to regain that level of intensity for that period of time, I can't imagine what that must be like. Yeah. Taking a story that's so dramatic and a personality is so driven and overachieving and try to chisel it down to three minutes is really hard. You want to be very respectful of the story and the experience, but you got to whittle it down and man, it was, it was really fun and John's a great guitar player and melody guy and wordsmith and so I think, I don't know, I, it, I don't want to say it was a quick, easy breeze, but it was fun and it went fast. And I think I'm really happy with the song. I hope yeah, you are. I am because uh, obviously I'm not a songwriter. I don't know anything about the mechanics of songs and etc. So the guys just uh, really asked me to kind of lay out, you know, what you know my career has meant to me, how I got into it, and what it's meant to me. And then we just started working back and forth off of those pieces to put together a, a complete story in the end, you know, and I, I thought we were successful with that. My name is Dwayne Bevett, and the title of my song is Hard Times Don't Last. It was a, a joy sp just spending time with Dwayne and Bart. And, uh, you know, you do these things, and uh, sometimes there's a lot of heavy emotion. But with this one, the heavy emotion was an incredible amount of pride in one's country and, and how one can serve. And so that's, that's pretty profound because I believe that uh, life is all about help. The way the reason grass grows and rain falls and life lives is to help somebody. And, and Dwayne and every veteran here uh, embodies that. This is called Hard Times Don't Last.
took me 27 years to scratch that itch. I was making money, but that ain't my kind of rich. Deep in my soul, I knew what I had to do. So I signed my name on the dotted line, on the bus heading south to a Georgia July. I learned to say yes, sir, and no, sir, and how to salute. What were we getting into? I looked to my left, I looked to my right, side by side at the bar or deep in the fight. Just a nod or a look between me and you. We're the only notes of what that we've been through. Cause hard times don't last, but hard men do. Another 24 months and we were overseas In a lawless land with people shooting at me We did all that we could to finally lock it down Well, I've come a long way from Mogadishu But I don't regret all that I've been through So when one of my tenth, my boys start coming around this family won't let you down. I look to my left, I look to my right, side by side at the bar or deep in the fight. Just a nod or a look between me and you. We're the only ones that know what we've been through. Cause hard times don't last, but hard men do. Now these days I get to chase the sun. Done all my work, now I'm gone. I look to my left, I look to my right, side by side at the bar, all deep in the fight. Just a night or a look between me and you. We're the only ones that know what we've been through. Cause hard times don't last. Yeah, they go so fast. Yeah, hard times don't last, but hard men do. Thank you, Dwayne.